For most people, it's hard to imagine living in an RV parked along a busy road like Northeast 33rd Drive. Now imagine someone setting fire to your home while you were sleeping in it. Cherie Thomas de Clue. I got woke up to it. Doesn't have to imagine. And people yelling, telling me to get out of my motorhome because it was on fire. It was just before 5 a.m. Monday morning. All of a sudden, this truck came by. Neighbor Claire Riley says it was a yellow moving truck. She says someone inside tossed out an explosive device. Big fireball like that, and um, it rolled down. Which rolled underneath Cherie's motorhome. And it just, boom, explosion, and it smoke and fire. Claire yelled to her husband, Andrew, for help. Ran to my house, got some water, tried to pit it out. Another neighbor used a fire extinguisher to put out the flames. I mean, she could have died. If it, I would have had my uh, propane tank on, uh, it would have blown me up. Fortunately, Cherie and her dogs made it out safely. But there's a lot of damage. The explosion even blew out her front windshield. Andrew has since popped it back in. I'm very grateful. Police and arson investigators are asking anyone with information, video or photos to share it with detectives. Many in Portland are tired of these RVs and the trash and crime some out here are responsible for. I wish there was a different way, but tough times. People living out here tell me drivers often take aim at their property with BB guns and paintball guns, damaging their cars. One man says he was recently walking by when someone threw a canned beverage out their window, barely missing his head. We're not supposed to be out here, but it's not fair for them to be doing stuff like that to us, thinking that they're better than we are. When that There's a saying about them being one paycheck from, from being out here. Don't matter if we're poor or homeless. So we all the same people is how I look at it. A request, even in these conditions, to be both human and kind. It could have been you instead of me. Someone could do it to your home like they did mine. In Northeast Portland, Catherine Cook, KGW News.